Hello everyone, this is Kwarun Fu from ZT. I'm the uh, PTO of the, Hub, the Homes project of the ONAP community. Um, today I'm going to give you a brief introduction on Homes project. Homes is basically uh, a correlation analysis engine, uh, which is intended for finding out the correlations between different alarms in the uh, ONAP community. Imagine uh, there, there's an enormous number of alarms coming from different uh, network equipment or different layers of that uh, net, uh, virtual network service. Uh, then how do you identify which one is the critical one or which one is the root cause? This is what homes do, actually. Architecturally speaking, homes is, uh, could be run in a standalone mode, which means that you can download uh, your pro, uh, or pull the dockers directly from the hub and uh, deploy it on your local machine and then it will work, it's there. But uh, in R1, in the ONAP community, Homes is um, deployed as a DCA analytics application, actually. It helps uh, the policy system to filter out the alarms to uh, reduce the uh, action triggering um, so that it will save a lot of uh, resources and time. During the uh, design time, Homes take uh, the root templates from the CRAMP system and uh, actually the root templates are deployed to homes via policy because these rules are considered as the configuration policies of this component. And the, after that, after the rules are deployed into homes, uh, it, it comes to the runtime. Uh, during the runtime, we take alarms from the VEST data collector, which is the input of our system. And uh, when everything gets into the homes, uh, it will do the analy uh, correlation analytic sorry, correlation analysis based on the alarm attributes which is contained in the alarms itself and com in combination with the information provided by the ANEI, which is uh, specifically the topology information of different resources. So we could do the analysis work based on all those information we got. And then after the root cause is identified, we, we will transform that into a a uh, control loop event message which is required by the policy and we put it back to the topic which is um, specified by the DMAP and also it's subscribed to by the policy component so policy could fetch it uh, from this topic and trigger a lot of uh, corresponding actions in order to implement the auto healing process. That's the whole workflow of this one.